Hi, my name is Tyler Bragginson, and I'm an Applications Engineer for Hawkridge Systems. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to change our SOLIDWORKS document units to display as fractions. Currently on this drawing, you can see I have several dimensions which are being displayed to three decimal places, and in fact are having to be rounded out. I'd like these dimensions to display as fractions. To change our document units, we can access the unit settings by going to our status bar, which is currently set to inch pound seconds and displays as IPS. This might also show custom or MMGS depending on your current document units. Clicking on this, we can change our units on the fly or we can edit the document units. We can also access our document units by going to tools, options, document properties, units. Once inside our unit settings, we can specify the unit type we'd like to use. And then we need to specify how to set our fractions. To do this, go to the type you'd like to set, which in this case is length, and currently being displayed to three decimal places. I want to display this in terms of sixteenths. If I click in my fractions box, I can specify the denominator I'd like to use. In this case, I'll use sixteenths. When I say OK, all the dimensions which can be displayed in terms of sixteenths or less will be changed to fractions. Here you can see I now have half inch as well as two and five sixteenths. However, my larger diameter is still being displayed as a decimal because it could not be set in terms of sixteenths. Let's try changing our denominator to 30 seconds. Now, all of my dimensions are correctly displaying as fractions. I've done this on a drawing, but the technique is the same for parts as well as assemblies. Here on the original part, you can see that the dimensions are still being shown as decimal places. To change it to fractions, I'll go to my units, edit document units, and again set my fraction denominator to 30 seconds. Now all of my dimensions on the part will also display in terms of fractions. Today we took a look at how to set our SOLIDWORKS dimensions to display as fractions. Thanks for watching.